That's not Chester. What happened? <laughs> Today we have a film for you all. I'm, you've already read the title, you know what it is. Unless I don't put it in the title. <laughs> this one though is not a review copy that was sent to us. Mm, I mean it kind of was. This one. Not by a distributor. <laughs> this one. This is something special. Do you want to introduce this? No. You want me to introduce you seem, I don't know if I have. You seem revved up for it. I don't know if I have the words for executive koala. <laughs> Benjamin. Benjamin sent us this as a Christmas. Was it Christmas? Yeah. Was it birthday? No, it's Christmas. It was Jesus's birthday. <laughs> Benjamin sent us this film because when we first met Benjamin, he told us this is like one of the craziest movies he's ever seen. Mm -hmm. And he was like, have you seen this movie? I was like, no, we've never seen Executive Koala. He was like, all right. And then in secret, he provided it to us. <laughs> so we don't know anything about this movie. No, no, we know very little other than it's like crazy. Yeah. Let's take a look downtown. <laughs> all right. Why did you say downtown? It's <laughs> I'm tired and I want to go to bed. Alice is gonna help you. All right, Alice, tell us about Executive Koala. No, apparently, Alice approves. Uh, Alice approves. Therefore, it must be good. So, what do we got inside? We got. Oh, this is also this is from uh, Synapse Films, uh, which I think they distribute weird weird movies like this, like weird underground independent type stuff. Uh, let's see. We have a, oh, there's an ad for m more Synapse films. Uh, the world sinks except Japan and the... Do you, do you see that? Do you, do you see what the, that is? Okay, that's our next, that's our next review right there. <laughs> Rug Cop! Beware his projectile toupee. Oh, it's by the same director. Oh, these are both by the same director. Yeah. I can read. Um, and let's take a look. What have, what have we got? What have we got? Benjamin, what have you gotten us into? I guess we need to find out. Yeah. Should I, do you want me to read you the description? Before no. Because we, we're going we're gonna to go watch want, it. I don't want a description. I want to okay. go in blind. Okay. That's fair. So I guess uh, we don't know what this movie is about. Other than that there's... A person with a koala head. And that's about or it. Or a koala with a person body. Yeah. Oh, and I don't know if you saw it or not, but on the disc there's also a rabbit. I saw that. Okay, yeah. so there's at least a koala and a rabbit. I guess we're gonna go take a look and see what's up with Executive Koala and why Benjamin was just like, you gotta, you gotta see Executive Koala. This is the one. Yep. So we'll be right back. Two hours later. So what? What's the house going? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. going alright. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Have you noticed we? Uh... Oh, sorry. I thought you were done with the cold open. We became animals. <laughs> <laughs> Cutting right to the chase. What did you think of executive? Koala. 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 Koala kachol. <laughs> Koala bear. <laughs> wow. That was a movie and we watched it. Thanks, Benjamin. <laughs> Look what you did to us. How do I describe Executive Koala? It's a movie about a person who is a koala. He just, he just literally just... He's just a koala. He's not like the big boss, no. but he's like the department... No, yeah, like, like the, the section boss. Yeah, like the floor manager sort yeah, of. Yeah, like the floor manager sort of. He has like a girlfriend and then his eyes turn red and he remembers stuff. And then he <coughs> he picks someone up and twists them around in jail. And, and they step on his belly. <laughs> and... And then there's a big Ferris wheel. And and at some point, it was the therapist all along. Whoa, spoilers. <laughs> I 
That's the best. That's the best synopsis of a movie I think we've ever done on this channel. I know. I, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> you're making me belly laugh. <laughs> this movie was so weird. Uh, this is a very strange movie. I no, I quite enjoyed it, it actually. Was, yeah. It was yeah. like it felt like four different movies that like. They like they all got started in some way, mm -hmm. but then they never got finished. And somebody was just like, "Oh, look at those four movies right there! I bet if we put them together, we can make a movie." Are you saying this is B movie? Oh my gosh! This movie is insane. It's insane. It's so weird, but it's like it's honestly it's really fun. Yeah. Like so, it kind of has that feeling of like you can tell everybody is having fun while making the movie. Right. Like there's this. I'm pretty sure it's the same dummy used every single time, <laughs> but it like this dummy takes a beating yes. it, multiple times, like like getting thrown against walls and like stomped, stomped on. on and uh, twisted around. Yeah, and, like <laughs> yeah, but like and like you can totally tell it's a dummy, mm -hmm. but I don't know, it, it works. It's, like yeah. it's it's this like quaintness of. A movie that is not high budget, mm -hmm. you know, high gloss, like, and I just had fun with it. I, it was, it, it, but I will say, it is a trip. I did not Sorry. know what was going on. No. And I'm still a little confused, but I think that's the point. That's, I will, I will say that's one thing to its benefit, is that it doesn't take itself seriously, but at the same time, it feels like it's completely committed to the bit of... There are just like basically furries in this world. I, 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 not I like, everybody. I know, but everybody's <laughs> like, yeah. Oh yeah, okay. yeah. There's a, there's a koala. There's a rabbit. There's a lizard. A frog. Or a frog. Yeah, he was a frog. He was Sorry. A frog. Yeah. Um, it, but it's like so committed to that that it's able to go beyond anything you could guess or expect. Yeah, yeah. Because it doesn't I mean, follow it, typical movie logic. No, it doesn't. It, it doesn't. makes it so that you can't predict what's going to happen. Well, I kept thinking, like, oh, it's, it's done. Like, we just reached the end. And then it would keep going for another half hour. Yeah. And, like, I was like, oh, now we're at, we're in prison. Okay. That happened. Oh, now we're not at prison anymore. And, uh, like, there, I just, I'm left with questions, but I'm not mad that I'm left with questions. Like, because it wasn't, like something that I took seriously. No. So I'm not like left wondering like, well, what the heck, you know? True, yeah. I, I'm just like, I bet if I watched it again, I might understand some stuff better. Yeah. Because it, there was a lot going on, it's chaotic. It's very There chaotic. are a lot of characters too, mm -hmm. actually. The surprising number. Mm -hmm. I, I, wanna, I wanted to ask you. Yes. What genre is this movie? Comedy, horror, mystery, romance. Yeah, I was kind of leaning that way too. I, like, I, I, my question to you is, is this a good Halloween movie? Absolutely. Yeah, I thought so yeah. too. Yeah, okay. I wouldn't have considered that, but yeah. Totally. Yeah, it's a Halloween movie. Totally. It's totally a Halloween movie. Yeah. Get, get this one and scoot your boot down into your couch and, and watch it with your loved ones, which can include yourself and <laughs> and well you know like maybe you're alone but you gotta love yourself right okay. yeah okay. that's what i'm coming at no that's fair so scoot your boots down and just watch it during october yeah 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 i would agree with that mm -hmm. it's yeah. a great movie for october yeah it's a great movie for any time but especially great for october i would agree i would agree have any of you seen this? this yeah. Is, this, so this was something that one of our friends just sent us on a whim. Mm -hmm. and We had never heard of it. We had never heard of it. And he was like, this is the best movie ever. You got to watch it. And we were like, okay, man. I All mean, right. he has like a film degree. So we were like, oh, well, it's probably pretty good. I, I think he probably got his film degree from a made up university. Probably. Yeah. I don't think it exists. No. Yeah. I think he just like uses a, an old coffee grinder. And, like holds it up and goes and pretends that he's and he's like I'm a director I'm Ben. <laughs> Wait a minute, a coffee grinder? Yeah, like an old one, like the hand crank ones. Oh, you mean like a like the film reel? Yeah, like a, like a camera, like 
Do you have to do that with a camera? No, no, back in the day you did. Oh, that's right. I forgot that Benjamin is 123. I mean... <laughs> now it all makes sense. It does.